Okay, quinone. This is quinone. This is a generic one. We've used it. It works exactly the same. I've tried it. I don't I don't give something out that I haven't tried. It works exactly as well. So both of them does exactly the same thing. It's the same stuff that's inside of it. When you want if you want to do it with a hose spray, much quicker, much easier. I hope you can hear me. Uh, I do 300 moles into the hose spray bottle. It's already filled with water. Always have to shake your coin off. Always. Any liquid, always shake it. And add your 300 moles to the bottle. I want to show you what it must look like when you spray because this is now for ants and for lice. It's for any insect, but it, it really does kill other things as well. I've seen that it's fine with my animals, with my dogs. Uh, it doesn't seem to bother them too much. It is better to use this. If you do this, uh, it's a systemic poison, so it will go through your skin and it will accumulate in your body like ar arsenic, and it will become more and more and more. It, it never goes out of your body, so it's, it's better to use uh, gloves with it. I've got the hose pipe lying here, giving some water to the plant. So I'm just going to clip it on. And you can immediately see it's white. It needs to be white. If it's not white, if I'm going to spray around the house for ants, I want the white stuff lying there. You can see how it's lying there. You want enough, you want it to go into the, that is, that is fine, that is adequate. When you want to spray it uh, on, a, on, on plant, remember that coin oil works millimeter, uh, milliliters per plant. If you're going to do, for instance, a rose bush, you will do three milliliters on a liter of water. If you're going to do a big orange uh, 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 citrus, you would do a fully grown one, you would do 30 milliliters on about 20 liters of water and it's a bark penetrator so you need to get it on the bark we will demonstrate how to throw it onto the bark now after we've finished with this one